How does a cognitive therapist work with a behavioral addict? Let's take two examples here. One, one being pornography, and one being gambling. How would we desensitize someone to these sort of stimuli? Uh, let's take the pornography first. Let's say every time a person sees pornography, there's a sort of a light bulb that goes on inside, and they fantasize about a woman or doing certain other things, and which brought, brings them into a further involvement with the pornography. What we would do in the course of treatment is exactly、uh, sort of what we've talked about, but we would bring the the images in, and in a slow, progressive, predetermined sort of set of stages where there may be a, a very Obscure piece of pornography. It may be a pornography of 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 a very mild type. And as we noted, your arousal or your stimulus stimulation from the pornography, we would ask you to go through a relaxation technique. So we would start to teach you that this does not cause that. That this stimuli need not cause that internal experience. And that over time we will bring it closer and closer in, in a literal sense. That when you're in the presence of it. When when the therapist isn't in the room or something, that it won't automatically bring about an internal experience as it has become when you're quote quote addicted. In a similar way, let's say it's gambling. Let's say every time you drive by the casino or or or, or walk into a casino,、um, you 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 see the the object of desire, so to speak. You you fantasize about winning a lot of money. Your arousal goes up. You you start getting excited and things like that. That's part of the addiction. That's that feeling stuff that we were talking about earlier. So what we would do in the in a, in a clinical session is sort of.、Uh, It would start with probably just talking about slot machines in, in a casino, and then ultimately would be bringing in pictures of a slot machine in a casino. But as we noted, as a professional, that the that your arousal was going up, as your stimulation, whether that trigger was activated, we we would go through a pre-rehearsed、uh, relaxation technique. So we would start to disassociate that high arousal with. That trigger or that stimulation, and over the course of many many、uh, sessions, we would eventually sort of even walk with you into a casino, hat with in hand, and sort of kind of,、uh, if you start to get aroused, we would ask you to go through the the relaxation thing and be able to eventually even touch a slot machine and not have that automatic addictive like response.